Hi right guys, Robbery46 here, welcome yourselves back to F1 2019. I am currently qualifying at Monaco. I really don't like Monaco. So, um, yeah, I've been struggling. I've been hitting pretty much every single barrier and uh, not been having a fun time around here. But uh, I'm hoping we can put some sort of qualifying lap together and, I don't know, get somewhere on the grid. I don't want to start at the back because it is an absolute, well, impossible pretty much to, to uh, overtake around here. Well, not impossible, but very, very difficult because the track is so narrow. So if I can uh, start in a decent position, then I should hopefully be able to hold that position for the whole race, even if I am going slowly. Okay. All right. Coming to the end of the lap. See what kind of lap time we can do. I've been struggling. I've been in like the one uh, twenty ones for quite a while. So this is looking better, looking much better. One fourteen point seven. That's much better than my previous lap. With qualifying, finished, we're starting on pole position. To remind ourselves of our top three: Joker, Butler, and Max Verstappen. With qualifying wrapped up, we now have our grid line up for the big race tomorrow. Be sure to join us then for what will no doubt be a fantastic race. I'm not sure about that. Good day today. Let's have your take on it. Yeah, it, it was it was you a, a fluky lap, weekend. if anything. Um, kind of done that that lap by accident, but yes, yeah, fine. Qualifying is over, and Devon is on the front of the grid. And so, what of it? Starting at the front with Devon alongside must bring back some memories from F2. Yeah, brings back how much of a dickhead he was back in F2. Great. Well, that's everything. Okay. See you later. Yeah, I've been dreading this race, I have to admit. Not been looking forward to this. I don't like Monaco. A proper road race, and in the true meaning of the word. That was how Mr. Monaco, the late great Graham Hill, once described this iconic event. The cars we drive have come a long way in the intervening half century, but still we race on those same public roads beside the Mediterranean Sea. There's no victory more coveted than that of the Monaco Grand Prix. Okay. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. Joker lines up on pole position. Yes, yeah, somehow we got pole. Butler, no idea how. P2. Moving on to the rest of the grid, we have Verstappen, Bottas, Lewis Hamilton, and Faber, Vettel, Raikkonen, Ricardo, and Pierre Gasly, Norris, Giovinazzi, Alexander Albon, and Stroll. Russell, Perez, Nico Hülkenberg, and Daniel Kvyat. Rojan and Robert Kubica takes the last spot on the grid, and with lights out, just moments away. Okay, right. Let's uh, let get let's get this over with. Um, I don't know how the race is going to go. The amount of times I was crashing into the barriers. Yeah, I don't know what's going to happen, but I'm not confident at all. This is a, a track that I've never liked really. Haven't got on with it at all. Here we go. Monaco. I mean, I get that it's an iconic track and it's all about the glitz and glamour around here, but that's about it. Collision with Butler. Don't, didn't even feel me hitting him. Oh, you mean when he went into the back of me? Okay. Right. But we're leading, and the good thing is we can pretty much set the pace of the race at the moment because they're not going to be able to get past. Well, I hope they're not going to be able to get past. They shouldn't be able to because uh, the track is very narrow. So uh, if we can go fast in the sections where it counts, then uh, we should be okay. It's just when we pit later on. I'll have to wait and see what happens when we run on the first lap. Coming to the end of the first lap. Lap 1 of 20. Okay. So we've got our main rival behind us. See, they uh, 
they're sticking to me, but they can't get past. And this straight isn't even that long. So, uh, yeah, then we go into corners again. I didn't exceed track limits, I was on the kerb. Yeah, all I've got to do is just do this the whole race. Even if I'm going slow. As long as they can't get past, then uh, yeah, jobs are good. And so uh, the, the fact that I don't like this track with the, the fact that it's very difficult to overtake around here. And um, I'm going to use it to my advantage. I mean, if you take away the glitz and the glamour, you've got one really bad racetrack. And obviously take away the history as well. Okay, coming to the end of lap two. Still in the lead. Yeah, if it was wider, I'm sure a few of them would have come past by now. But, like I say, I'm going to use that to my advantage. Good job. That was the fastest lap of the race so far. DRS is now enabled, but there's only one DRS zone on this track, and that is the start-finish kind of straight, because it's not really a straight. Well, we've not hit a barrier yet, so uh, that's a win in my book. We're on lap three and we've not hit anything. Okay, right. Oh, that was so close then. Okay, well, hopefully we can still stay in the lead. I've messed that corner up. and Yeah, that was exceeding track limit, so uh, I'll take that. Butler is right on me, but like I said, he can't get past. If he gets any closer, he's going to be in the uh, the rear of my car. So he's going to be using DRS now, but he's not coming past. Yeah, I'm going to try and go to... What lap should we go to? Six or seven, or maybe lap eight? then that will give us, what, 12 laps on the... 12, 13 laps on the mediums. Now I think I'll try and go for a little bit longer with these uh, soft tyres. Try and stretch them out as long as possible. Unless they really fall off a cliff, but they seem alright at the moment. Seem to be doing the job. So, right, end of lap four. I've just realised as well, I don't think I said this was a four-wheel Friday in the intro. Yes, this is, of course, a four-wheel Friday. Friday when we play a car game, basically. So, uh, back with career with F1 2019. We've got Butler right behind me. But again, he can't quite get past. Fine, through here. I'm not dropping them. If they came past, they would more than likely pull away. But uh, I'm not going to let them. That's the secret. Don't let them pass. So lap five at the moment. I don't know if I can keep this up the whole race. I mean, things are definitely going to change when we go into the pit because we're not all going to pit at the same time, obviously. So we're going to come out behind some people 
And that could potentially be where we end up losing the race, but we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Okay, right through here, run to the line now. So over the line. Push now. We're boxing this lap. Uh, I don't think we are, Jeff. Gonna leave it one or two more laps. Just want to hold on for as long as possible. Even though my lap times are starting to to tumble. F1 cars need a handbrake so you can handbrake drift around the corners. <laughs> down. Uh oh, no, no, uh oh. That's fine, we got away with that. We got away with that. I thought we were going to get a penalty then. Box this lap, please. Yeah, we are really off the pace at the moment. But again, it doesn't matter because they've still not come past. They haven't been able to get past. Just make yourself as wide as possible. And uh, they won't be able to uh, get past. So Bottas is up to third. Keep going. I'm doing fine. Doing better than I thought we would. Lap 7, I've still not hit anything. Bottas can't get past Butler at the moment. There's so many cars close together. It's, it's almost like the safety car's out. Fine, we're doing fine. That was better, got the car stopped that time. And this has been a better lap than the last one. Still way off the pace though. Okay, right, let's do one more lap and then we'll put it on lap eight. Some people already in now. Teammate is in the pits. Sebastian's in for his stop. Oh no! There we go. I've clipped the uh, barrier. Oh dear, that is definitely going to affect the performance. Just, just be defensive. You'll be fine. If we could run at two miles an hour, and we'd probably, uh, well. We, we wouldn't still win, but go through the corners at two miles an hour. Just make it as wide as possible. Come on. We can do this. We can do it. Pit on this lap, and then we will see what happens. Just make the corners, and uh, we'll be okay. If I was Devon Butler, I'd be getting so frustrated. Fuel target is plus one. Faster engine modes are available. Yeah, that's fine. I'm happy with what I'm using at the moment, except for we're going to need a new front wing. In we go. This is going to... Well, this is definitely not going to help us because we need a new nose. Quick, quick, quick. Go, 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 go. Let's go. go. Exit now. We're racing on the exit. Go. Go okay. Now. So we are behind two cars there. Bottas and Butler. Yeah, they got out before me. Pit strategy complete. See these tyres through to the end now. Okay. I will do my best. Here we go. So we're currently in P12. Oh 
but remember we haven't quite got the uh, the grip that we had with the softs but it's fine everything's bunching back up again and now I'm on the receiving end of being in a little train unless I can get past into 11th place use a bit of slipstream maybe outbreak into the next left hander I'll give it a go. Are we close enough up the inside? Yes, we are. There we go. There's one position. Up to 11th now, just behind Verstappen. Lap 9 of 20. Let's see if we can uh, get onto the back of these guys. Are we going to be close enough to use DRS? Apparently not. Okay. Oh. Vapor's just coming out the pit. Uh oh. Oh, I can't get past him. No. No. Damn it. The car ahead of you has just fitted the hard tyres. Car ahead now on the hard compound. Okay. And uh, he's in the way as well. So we're back down to 11th place. Yeah, all bunching up again. Oh, put it in neutral then. Don't want to be doing that. So, through here. Not close enough to have a go into the uh, the chicane. Oh, we're a bit later on the brakes though. Pretty much going to be our best bet trying to outbreak him down into the chicane. There's no really other places where we can do it. I'll tell you what, I don't think he's close enough to use DRS, but we are. Ah, here we go. We can get into 10th place here. Yeah, there we go. 10th place. Can we catch the next group? So we've lost a bit of time there. Thank you. Try and catch the next group. It shouldn't be too hard because they should start bunching up again, which they are. Yeah, we're on them now. We are with them. So we're going to have to go careful not to go into the back of anyone. Okay, into the tunnel. We don't get as good an exit as uh, Verstappen at that one, so we're not close enough to have a lunge into the chicane. Can we get close enough to him to have a go down the straight? The trouble is he's going to have DRS as well. Yeah, we're not close enough at the moment anyway. Oh, oh. No, we're not close enough. We can use DRS, but we're not close enough to get past. Well, fastest lap of the race, though. I'm pulling away a bit. So, still in 10th place. No one else is pitted at the moment. Or no one in front of me. Come on, come on. Maybe what I should have done is... Well, first of all, not hit the barrier and damage my wings straight away. Um, but maybe I should have stayed out a few more laps so that everyone... Could uh, pitted and then I could have had just some clear tracks to my own thing, but, but saying that my pace was dropping anyway. I don't know. Is anyone going to pit on this lap? Anyone ahead of me pitting? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Staying in tenth place then. 
closer to Verstappen this time, but not close enough to get past. Okay, you're catching the car ahead, but remember we need to get to the end of the race on these tyres. Jeff, I can see I'm catching the, the car ahead. I'm not blind. There's a big group of us, actually. So this group goes up to fourth place. So Bottas, he pitted when I did, but he's in this group. I think Butler's in here as well. But they're a few places ahead of me. Not close enough to do anything at the moment. So, is anyone going to pit this lap? Or maybe everyone's pitted. Oh, no, someone's come in. One person has pitted. There we go. So, we're up to P9. I mean, the group behind isn't catching, which is a little bit... Oh, nearly into the back of the stap in there. Just had to take avoiding action. I thought the group behind might have started catching up, seeing as we're all bunching up again. But there's quite a big... Oh, I think they are just starting to close back in. But that is a pretty big group behind... get back onto a normal track. Oh, I think someone else has come into the pit. Well, two people have come into the pit, I think. So we could potentially make two places up here. P8. Oh, Norris. Come on, there we go, we squeezed past him. Seventh place. I'm assuming that is going to be it for people pitting. Everyone else must have pitted. So I'm assuming that's Hamilton in the lead. So we've got Bottas in our group, but he's at the front of it now. See if he starts to pull away. The car behind you has just fitted the hard tyres. Car behind, running hards. Thank you very much. Oh, no! Bugger. Your front wing is damaged. And we got a time penalty. Okay, it's all going wrong now. No, no. Oh, no. Yes, all right. They've already given me a time penalty, Jeff. Oh, we're not far from the end as well. On to lap 16. Oh, okay. That's not good. Oh, whoops. <laughs> I think we may have just caused an accident. Oh dear, we may have uh, caused Weber to uh, to uh, DNF. Whoopsie daisy. Oh dear. Okay, we've got serious uh, understeer now. Your speed, our delta is too low and we risk a penalty. Slow your pace immediately. Okay, okay. Is that fine? Can I go now? I can go now. Ooh! 
Oh no! The wheels come off! Oh dear. Well, that pretty much sums up uh, Monaco for me. So, DNF at Monaco. <sighs> I'm just glad that that race is over, to be honest. Oh dear. It wasn't going too badly up to that point. I just had to outbreak Victory myself into the, the back of Verstappen. Anthony Davidson, how do you think they were able to set themselves Verstappen apart won? Well, they played the same how the hell did he win from there? Action. There are so many factors to worry about once the race is neutralised. I mean, okay, that was rubber? weird. Do you have the space behind you? How much fuel can you save? If you answer all of those questions correctly, you'll have a good chance. And that's exactly what happened today. Red Bull put up an outstanding fight for the front position today, and it's great to see it paid off for them. They do so much for the sport that you can't help but be delighted by today's race win. Well, obviously my shunt uh, gave him the pace to get to the win. Well, well done Verstappen. Okay. That race is over with. Let's see what effect this result has had on the driver's yeah, what has stand. that done to the standings, it's a great actually? Result for Lewis Hamilton, who moves further ahead at the top of the table. We've dropped to so fourth Davidson, behind Vettel. Your driver of the day? Nico Hülkenberg did an excellent job out on the track today. He played aggressively and knew exactly when to capitalise on openings throughout the race. Wow. Let's move on to the constructors. There we go. Mercedes continue to extend their lead. There was also a strong showing from the McLaren team today as they make their way up the standings. Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave this video here. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave this video a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel for more content. And I shall see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to stay safe and wash your hands. See you.